Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today I am finally trying Beauty Bakery's, a couple of their lip products. Um, I haven't tried them, but people swear by them. So I wanted to try a couple. I'm trying their liquid metallic lipstick and their liquid matte lipstick. And we'll start with the metallic. Probably should have brought my Vaseline in here, but it didn't. It comes in this nice, pretty packaging. The metallic comes in a metallic. Uh, this is, I got the hazelnut swirl. Am I doing this right? Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, it's like a metallic blue. It says lip wit, lip whip, not lip wit, lip whip. And yeah, you can see how much product you have in there. And it's cloudy, but inside it's kind of like a rounded whip. Okay, let's talk about it. Uh, it is, it says craving something deliciously dark. Our hazelnut swirl lip whip is the perfect afternoon pick me up. Brewed with love, this high pigmented metallic matte formula will last from one latte to another. And let's see. It says use the dough foot for a seamless application. Wait 60 to 75 seconds between layers. For max benefit, we recommend no more than three layers. And it says long lasting, smudge proof and waterproof. Don't worry about eating your makeup with our lip whips. They stay on your lips, not your food. I like that. Apply your lip whip and leave it at home. Don't worry about reapplying and it is vegan. So this retails for $20. And the doe foot, it's kind of like at an angle, but a point. Okay, let's try it out. It goes on smooth. Um, I thought it was going to be a lot more metallic-y. Let's try another layer. It's not bad that it's not metallic-y. There we go. Okay, there's the metallic. Okay, don't do what I just did. So you lose the lipstick. Don't put your lips together. You lose part of the lipstick. Okay, this is a color that I probably normally wouldn't wear because it, I feel like it's too dark for me, but I think it's beautiful. It's really pretty. It kind of has a dimension to it, like dark to light in the center. Okay. Let's wait for it to dry a bit, and then let's see if it transfers. But I can feel it drying on my lips a bit, but that's with any matte. Uh, Long-lasting lipstick, lip whip, uh, you feel it kind of constricting the lips a bit sometimes. Um, I don't mind it. Some people don't like it, <laughs> but... It makes my this makes my teeth look white <laughs> uh, okay let's see only little has come off and that's probably because of the way I line my lips so let's try it again so I put a little you know how when you line your lips some kind of goes out yeah no Let me have some of my burners and see. Mm -mm. Nothing around the rim. Okay. But yeah, don't put your lips together. Don't do that because it'll mess up the consistency. It's not a lipstick. All right, let me take this off and let's try the matte Oof. okay guys it took me forever to get this off with the vaseline which is good 
<laughs> but for me, not good because I like to take my mats off with Vaseline. I'm she has something that you can take this off with. So, excuse me, I would recommend probably buying her lip whip remover because you see how red my lip I don't know if you can see how red my lips are, but I was scrubbing to get it off with Vaseline, which is good, meaning that um, oily stuff isn't just going to wipe off that. But yeah, oh, I guess I got a good uh, exfoliation. <laughs> All right, the matte lip whip in cherry flambe. You guys know I love a good red. It says conquer the world with this smudge proof fiery red, an essential crimson shade that will make the perfect addition to your collection. There's no other red that would make your date night more of a date night than cherry flambe. And this retails for $20. And it says do the same thing as the metallic. Don't add more than two, three, I'm sorry, three layers. So let's give it a, a world. I wish the doe foot was a little bit more uh, different where it absorbed a little bit more product because I feel like it runs out of product as I am um, just putting on the one layer. So let's, let's put more on. It's not a deal breaker. This is definitely a cherry red. It is pretty. With match, you always make sure you gotta get that line right. <laughs> um, yeah. This is pretty. Wait for it to dry. Now you can do this with this one. It's, it's a little sticky, but not don't do that as much uh, because it's not a lipstick again. Okay, let's see. It means it's still drying a bit. Yeah, because the more I do it, the less comes off. So, and yeah, it's not wiping off on my hand. <laughs> Let me give it a, yeah. Okay, this is what I will say. Um, I'm not a huge matte girl. I do have a few mattes. Uh, but this, her, her lipsticks are, are here to stay. <laughs> If trying to take them off is any indication, they are here to stay on your lips. Mm hmm And that's what you're looking for in a long lasting matte lip product. You want it to stay. So yeah, this is a great product. It stays on your lips. It is, um, it has, it's not flaking right now. Sometimes, after you eat and at the end of the day, you know, mats can sometimes start to flake. It's just my first impression of this. This is just, it wasn't flaking when I was trying to get it off with the Vaseline, I tell you. <laughs> so I'll wear this all day. And uh, if there's any updates, you know, I'll put it in the description box. I hope this helped you guys figure out if her lip whips were something you wanted to try. And if you're into matte lipsticks, and you want them to stay on and last, based on me trying to get this off with Vaseline, yeah, these are, this isn't transferring, <laughs> not anytime soon. <laughs> so yeah, I first thing I thought of was kissing on weddings, yeah. Yeah, this will stay put, yeah. So thank you so much guys for watching. I will see you next time. And I hope you have an amazing day. Bye. Hey guys, I'm just doing this at the end of the video because I did eat something. I ate a um, turkey sandwich and some chips. And so it did start it to come off a bit, but I'm assuming, you know, it says it, you know, you can leave it at home and with food and all that stuff. Well, I wouldn't leave it at home. I'm assuming I can just touch it up. So let's see. Sorry, guys.
yeah don't do that don't don't put your lips together guys like it's lipstick it's such a habit for me yeah you can just touch it up and now it's back on it didn't crumble or anything of that nature and it didn't uh my line isn't that great sorry guys uh but it didn't crumble it did not um dry out my lips horribly where not even a little bit where uh my lips are looking you know bad <laughs> uh so yeah i hope that helps you guys so there we go there's a little update i'll see you guys next time bye